Hello, today we'll be drawing a nice fluffy cupcake. We're going to start with the two eyes. It's going to be a small circle right here. And then same on the other side. Once you have those circles complete, we could add the small inner circle and one smaller one right below it. Same thing on the other side. And finally, when you're done, we could fill those in. With your eyes complete, we could do the mouth in the middle. It's just gonna be a lima bean shape. So we're gonna go from here all the way around and connect there. And let's just add a cute pair of teeth in the middle. And that completes the face. Now we could draw the cupcake. We're gonna start from the top left around this point and go down to this point. To do this, we're just gonna curve it slowly down to there. Same thing on the other side, top left point, bottom right point. Just curve down. And then let's do the wrapper of the cupcake. It's just going to be a zigzag pattern from here to here. So we're going to start by going down, up, down, up, down, until you reach the end right there. Now let's just connect the cupcake to the wrapper. I'm going to draw two lines for the back of the wrapper, like there, and right there. Now for the side of the cupcake, we're going to just do a line from here all the way down to right there. Go down like that. Same thing on the other side to this point. Go down to there. And now let's connect the two with a curve. like so. Now we could add um, some patterning for these uh, cupcake uh, folds. And then we're not going to connect it from the top to bottom. We're going to add a little bit of space and we're just going to go down to there like this. And we're just going to connect all of these points. And this should give us some uh, folding patterns on the cupcake itself. And the last one right there. Now with that done, we could draw the frosting on top. We're going to start with a curve. Down. All the way up. And then we're going to add two apprentices on each side. Two more. And then we're going to connect this point to here to make the first swirl. Like so. And this point to this point. And this should give us a spiral swirl. Once that's complete, we're going to add a little bit of a curve from here to here. That will allow us to complete this top swirl. Finally, we could add the very top piece. It's just going to be a curve like this. And then complete it like so. Once your cupcake is complete, we could add a little bit of detail on the bottom. 
it's just gonna be a little place for your cupcake to sit when I draw a curve like this and same thing on the other side now we're gonna add three more on the bottom one two three We move the paper up a little bit so you can see there you go for the bottom let's get this in frame once you have that complete we're gonna just add the little details just gonna be these D shapes Fill in the detail. And it's almost like a little coaster fabric piece at the bottom of the cupcake. Now let's add a little bit of color. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more tutorials weekly.